So one of the complaints he talked to us was about getting the club head underneath the hands. Mm. And typically when you get, not all the time, but for him, I think, when you get the hands to move out, it's a little bit easier for the club to want to lay behind you. So I want to work on a, a feeling on the way down of detaching the arms, mm. uh, almost feeling like you're steepening the club with the torque of the club, not necessarily swinging it way out. His tendency is when he tries to torque the club towards the ball, he does it by moving the hands out, mm. which ultimately almost makes it kind of go this way. It's actually kind of anti what he wants to do. So there's two things that's happening there, Taiga. The first thing is, you know, I'm actually steeping the club. Mm. The second thing is I'm actually twisting the shaft this way. Slightly hand path that's a little bit more down the wall mm. will now be kind of swinging out to in but not by doing it so much with the hands mm. doing it more so mm. the way the club head moves the more i pitch the club towards the ball mm. the face angle is actually kind of more shut as if i flatten the club head mm. right ah. so basically you caught yourself a little bit too much into like a victor hoblin model we're doing something similar we try mm. to get a basically we try to get the body a little bit more matched up should, which should get it deeper mm. And then also focusing on getting the hands a little bit more down the wall should also kind of get everything a little bit more behind us.